What my ponyos, Andy with Andy Vlogs, decided to share with you guys another video here. This is a tutorial on how to get this ugh, display information ugh, off of your screen and to turn your Sony Alpha Series camera into basically a webcam. If you want to shoot, I don't know, really nice video when you're doing conference calls, I'm going to be doing it for video streaming because this is a really nice camera. And man, look at that. Look at that. It's so good. So I haven't been able to figure it out until now. I don't know why I Google searched all of the terms I could think of to, to get this interface taken off. And all it took was uh, about a half an hour of me drooling through every single one of the, uh, the, the screens in the interface within the menu. To figure it out and so i'm gonna make your life easy my job here is to show you how to do it and i'm gonna try to do it as concise as i can so just as i mentioned when you plug your sony alpha series it could be the 6000 it could be the 6300 the 6400 that just came out in 2019 which is what i'm actually using uh if 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 you want to turn this into a webcam and you want to get rid of all of this junk you simply have to go into the menu and so uh that that box is so irritating how it just follows me and uh but now i don't have to now i can just enjoy the wideness of this beautiful beautiful camera so uh, i'm gonna switch to my gross ugly camera okay so you can see that i've got my camera's display and then i've got my ugh, yuck gross old webcam it's actually a really nice webcam it's the logitech c922 you can get it on amazon for about 60 bucks it's one of the best usb webcams out there Anyway, uh, the consumer, 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 consumer. I don't spend anything for the really high end stuff. But anyway, I'm trying to turn this camera into a webcam and this is how you do it. So I'm gonna take it off of its tripod and I'm gonna show you how to do it. So here we go. Unmount it. You'll notice that I've got it plugged in. I've got the mini USB and micro H, no, mini HDMI or micro HDMI and micro H USB. One of those things that's plugged in because, well, I want to make sure that it doesn't uh, die on me and also it looks good. So I'm going to turn this around and I'm going to show you how to do this. So once I hit menu, it goes into the menu settings and you'll notice here at the very top of the settings, you've got, you know, your six different main categories. You've got your my menu settings, setup, playback, network, movie one, image quality. I don't know why I did that backwards, but I did. Uh, but as you just saw, I was under setup under the briefcase, you go into setup and then you go to the fourth tab over and you go into HDMI settings. I I've been here before and I went through all of this, but I guess it just didn't make sense because I didn't have it plugged in. Now that I had it plugged in and I was goofing with it, I could see exactly what I needed to see. So I, s I have the HDMI set to uh, auto resolution. I've got the output to 60p, which is the best. Uh, and then this is where you want to go. You want to go HDMI info display. That's what they call it. That's how you get rid of, again, all of the display information. So voila, here we go. HDMI settings, HDMI info display off. Boom. It's a webcam. Can you believe it? Isn't that beautiful? Oh, let's, d let's double up my beautiful face. Double up the beautiful, 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 beautiful. So isn't that amazing? I mean, that's it. That's as, as quick as it can be. Uh, this is a tutorial under five minutes. Thank you so much, guys, for joining me. My name is Andy. This is All Games Played. Did I, did I do All Games Played or Andy Vlogs? I don't know. Signing out. See you guys. Thanks.